10,000 villagers versus this unbreakable castle. There's three gates between me and the villagers. Plus, I got all kinds of traps set up. Will they be able to make it through? Let's find out. Unleash the villagers! <laughs> Look at these dumb villagers. They're running straight into the arrows. Come on now, y'all haven't even made it to the castle yet and y'all already dying? Oh, Bruh. looks like we're running out of arrows and they are not stopping. Look, they're just stepping over all the dead bodies. Damn savages. What do you expect though? They are villagers after all. It's not like they have souls or emotions or something. Yo, they're building ladders now? Chill, chill. It's all good. I already learned not to underestimate these dumb villagers. You could say I have a little bit of experience with them. That's why I had something special cooked up. I hope y'all are in the mood for some homemade soup. And by homemade soup, I mean lava! Ha! Imagine that, just lava hitting you right in the face. No, God, please, no! Look at these guys, abandoned ship, except... Yeah, I guess they chose fall damage instead. Oh! Bruh. Look at these guys. They're literally stuck inside the cooling lava. Two hours later. It's like a giant villager cake. Or turd. Depends on how you look at it. These guys are still going strong, eh? I gotta say, I'm impressed. Villagers are some of the most resilient people I've ever seen. Even if they are the scum of the earth. Come on, get your grubby villager hands off my castle walls. Yo, did this guy just craft a stone pickaxe? Aw, is he trying to save his dead friends? Yo, that's so... Huh? Yo, chill, chill. Bro was planning to build stairs this whole time? Now, because of the stairs, all the other villagers are getting up the wall too. Hey, hey, hey. Ah, the first wall has been breached. It's all good. Y'all knew I was prepared, right? Unleash the mercenaries! I hired my own guys, just in case something like this were to happen. Look at them! They're fully decked out. Straight up chads. This guy's even got a giant sword. Yeah, boy, it's time to kill some villagers. Any second now. Okay, am I missing something? Where are all the villagers? No, seriously, I sent out all my mercenaries and now the villagers are nowhere to be seen? Oh, come on now! What a bunch of- Bruh. They're retreating! Mission failed. We'll get them next time. Well, hooray, I guess. I didn't expect victory to come this easily. I guess this video is going to be a little shorter than usual. Huh? Ah. What did you say? Apparently, these damn villagers have compromised my trade routes. So what, right? Well, those trade routes bring in food, water, and all kinds of supplies to the castle. Without them, we're eventually gonna starve in here. Huh? Those damn snakes! They're using my supplies to build their own camp. They built a stable with the horses they stole. They're making an armory too? Great, now they're all geared up too. Wait, what is that? Zen mode is a weeb. Yo, seriously? That's it, suit up boys. Get out there and show them what happens when they talk sh Bruh. Come out, come out wherever you are. Not so tough now that my boys pulled up, huh? Huh? Wait a second. What kind of fugazi is this? Yo, what? Did the villagers just lock my mercenaries out? Let me get this straight. They built a fake war camp and baited us? Wow, and they have the audacity to build their war camp inside my castle gate, and they're using my stolen resources to do it. Oh, that's it. Just wait till I... Yo, is that a battering ram? Oh, no, no, no. Don't tell me they're gonna use that to smash down my second gate. Chill, chill. They're coming for the second gate already? This is a new low, even for these sneaky, scummy villagers. Oh, I see you're cheering now, eh? Y'all think you're so smart. Y'all left me no choice. Time for my second party trick. Unleash the mutant golems! Yeah, boy. Mutant golems? Smash! I had my team of super nerds make some adjustment to the golem. It's basically like a regular golem, but way worse. <laughs> Look at these guys, silly villagers, flying's for pigs. <laughs> Look at these guys. Oh, this is never gonna get old. Oh, oh, there they go again. Oh, wait, is it over? No, no, there they go again. And how about those tents? Get that out of here. That's what you get for setting up your war camp inside my castle.
Oh, what's this guy up to? Is he brave or stupid? Let's find out. I guess he's stupid then. Get him, boys! Yo, what? When did that get there? Yo, they made a lava trap to melt my precious mutant golems. Seriously? So it turns out, the villager leader went outside and offered the mercenaries a cut of the profit if they helped raid the castle. So the mercenaries betrayed me, and now the villager troops doubled. Yo, that's no fair. Now the giant swords are working for the villagers? Then they told the villagers about my golems and helped them dig this giant trap. The second gate is down already? Man, where's all the loyalty these days? Look at these guys all coming through. Uninvited. Damn smelly villagers. And you mercenaries. I expected better from you. Okay, fine. That's all it's gonna be. Whatever. I ain't salty. You're salty. You guys did good. Bravo. You should be proud of yourselves. Really? But have you ever heard of the saying, out of the frying pan and into the fire? Unleash the dragons! Y'all see that? Dragons, boy! Oh, you guys are screwed now. This is what happens when you trespass in a zone you're way underleveled for. A few moments later. What happens when you set thousands of villagers on fire? Same thing as anything else. Burn, mother bruh! And try to cook up those mercenaries extra. That's what they get for betraying me. Ooh, something so satisfying about that. <laughs> That's what they get for building on my land illegally. All right, what else can we set on fire? What about that giant pit they dug? Because why not? Yo, what? Bro, they just killed one of my dragons. What the hell? When did they build that thing? So you're telling me, once they trapped the golems inside the pit, they melted them down and used them to build giant ballista arrows? Okay, they're aiming again. No! Yo, that's already two of my dragons. Okay, that's it. We're getting out of here. Run, boy. Get out of here while you still can. I believe in you. These are dark times. Dark times indeed. We're cornered. These damn villagers are gonna break through the final gate any second now. We're out of options. I've only got one choice left. <laughs> I never thought this day would come where I'd have to surrender to these awful, awful things that we call villagers, where I just lay down and admit defeat. Psych! I'd never take an L from these stupid villagers. They won the battle, but this war ain't over. I got one dragon left, boy! So long, suckers!